Hi, I'm Peter Triantos and welcome Dolce Magazine to my studio. I want to show you guys around and I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Come on in. What art means to me is art means freedom. It means uh, love. Love is a key word. Uh, I don't want to be making art that has any kind of connotations other than love. I want to be spreading the word. I want to make people happy. That's what I want to do. That's my goal here. Love brings us into this life. Love should take us out. I don't know. I think it's about love. L-O-V-E. Period, 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 period. It is my wife that, that sparks everything. So, you know, of course I was an artist before that time, but it plays a big role that you have somebody that absolutely backs you. If you don't have it, you will struggle. Uh, it will come out in some other form. Uh, Serafina, for me, my wife, uh, played a very important role to the uh, blossoming of my art, if I may say. The role that the artist should play is that once you have a voice, which I'd have to say that art has given me a, a, a voice to make sure that you use it properly. Do not use it to exploit, to use the voice properly to help humanity. Why am I donating to every cause that, that is coming my way? Because I believe the causes are good. If they're not good, I will not donate. I believe everybody has a responsibility to one another. I believe like it says, we're all brothers, we're all sisters. We're one. I see myself always in action and to be flowing. I don't want to see myself fixating on one thing or another, the past, the future. I want to live in the present. I want to be present. I want to be here and now, and that's what I love. I love to be present. I love to enjoy the time. You know, you can be chasing the future or the past. It's uncertain. To live now in the present is something that we should all practice. It's very hard to do because you're looking to retirement. You're looking at your past. Look to now, enjoy the moment, savor the moment, take time to smell the roses. Another thing is you want to look at yourself and say, am I living the life that I want? If not, then make those changes because I'll tell you one thing, only you can make those changes. If you're not spending enough time with your family and the direction you're heading is only going to keep you less and less in touch, then make those changes. That's all I want to say and I'm uh, saying it with all my heart, truly I am. Miami, New York City, uh, you want to name it, Paris, you know, we've been everywhere, so, uh, you know, next, solo show in Greece was supposed to happen, COVID delayed that, solo show in London was supposed to happen, COVID delayed that, it doesn't matter, we're looking forward to Dubai right now, we have a deal with Dubai, with, uh, you know, Rev de Moi, uh, a group show, many, many things, and you know what, you cannot really plan perfect there has to be error there have to has to be room for error uh, if you knew everything how can there be room for creativity creativity comes when there is uncertainty i'm not an intellect by any means but i can tell you this uncertainty you put me under pressure i will produce more than you could ever imagine the message for me is uh, simply this for the young generation for anybody, whoever it is, is to make sure that they build their foundation strong and to believe in themselves. Only then, with a strong foundation, could they go forward without tipping it over or whatever. I think that the fact is this, you control your destiny in many ways, and if you have a strong core and beliefs in yourself, only great things will happen. But you can't go through the threshold halfway saying, oh, I'm in, I'm out. You have to move through the threshold and uh, you know, it's like uh, getting married and saying I have somebody on the side. It doesn't work, don't do it. Get married, go forward, go through the threshold and believe in yourself and whatever you're gonna do. If I can use that as an example.